Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. My name is Anda Malescu and I am the owner of Malescu Law, a law firm based in Miami, Florida. Here at Malescu Law, we specialize in serving Florida companies and foreign companies and investors in the area of business corporate and immigration law. If you need to reach out to us, you have our contact in this video and below this video. But before we get started, please subscribe to our channel by clicking the bell button. Today, we are going to speak about the cancellation of Trump administration executive order 100014 that bans the issuance of certain immigrant visas uh, at U.S. consulates and embassies abroad as of April 23rd, 2020. We are going to look at the cancellation of this order on February 24, 2021 and the effects of the cancellation. On February 24, 2021, President Biden canceled the ban on certain immigrant visas that has been in effect since April 23, 2020. And the U.S. Department of State has provided some instructions on how do we move forward from here and what to do if you have applied for an immigrant visa or you are applying for an immigrant visa at the U.S. consulates and embassies abroad. So, with that being said, um, here are some of the options. One, if you have applied for an immigrant visa at the U.S. consulate or embassy abroad, but you have not been scheduled for an interview or you have not had your interview yet as of February 24, 2021, then your application will be processed according to the schedule for the resumption of visa services at each U.S. Embassy and Consulate. In other words, you should contact the U.S. Consulate and Embassy where your visa is pending to find updates about your interview. Two. If you already applied for an immigrant visa and your petition is still valid and you already had your interview but you were refused the immigrant visa because of Presidential Proclamation 100 14 then you should wait for instructions from the U.S. consulate or embassy where you had your interview. Three, if you have a diversity visa issued in 2020 that is still valid, you should try to enter the United States immediately, even if you have an annotation on your visa that says entry subject to PP 10014. And four, for those of you that have been selected for a diversity visa for the fiscal year 2021, you should wait to be contacted about your interview date for the visa given the resumption of visa services at U.S. consulates and embassies abroad. This is all for today. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to our channel. And if you need to contact us, you have our information in this video and below this video. We will see you soon. Bye.